Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Madden 18, and your boy got paid out for the Floyd fight, so I'm going to be opening up an NFC East Gold Bundle. First, we're going to open up one Baby Goat Pack, because I love these Baby Goat Gold Packs. Provide so much value, and so we're going to go ahead and rip this. There's the Randy. You want to get two Baby Goats, if all possible. Doesn't look like I'm going to get it. No. Oh, I got John Ross, though. That's a nice pull. Alright, so I'm happy. Happy with that baby goat pack. There's like some construction or something going on outside my house, and I don't know what's happening. But I bought extra points because, I don't know, I got paid out for the Floyd fight, and so I'm just, I'm just gonna have points because I'm coming up on the level 20 pack, so I need points for that, and then I obviously, oh, okay, hold on, we can open up this daily quick sell. 2k coins okay all right so let's get into this we'll save our elite topper for the end but like i said i just need extra points just in case maybe we'll open up one more gold or goat gold pack the end okay all right justin Pugh. we're starting this one out on fire elite to start it out a high gold that's good stuff like i said i don't think i'm going to complete those solo challenges i just don't I don't know. I just don't have that much interest in them. All right. All right. All right. Two. Another. I, I thought for a second that Darren McFadden was an elite. I was like half looking. I was looking up at something, a notification, and I was like, I looked up and I saw that kind of. Okay. Let me get back to stop rambling. All right, nothing in that pack. Adjusted pew has got to be worth a little bit, a little chunk of change. The the elite linemen tend to have some decent value. All right, we're just pulling this straight gold pack almost. That's good. The gold should go up in value. I might see. We'll see after this one. I'll try to make a. I'll, not, I'll try to make a team. All right, the more gold, the better. Alright, we got two more of these, and then we got our Elite Pack. Maybe one more Elite. One more Clutch Elite. The issue is, is you can't, like, overlap players. That's gonna be the biggest issue, is overlapping players. Okay, our, okay, Brad Wing. Oh, we're going double Elite! Devin Kennard and Brad Wing to end it up. Well, I feel like I've gotten a ton of Giants players. I'm not getting, like, any... Okay, Elite Topper time. Okay, well... Oh, my gosh, another Giant. All four of our Elites were Giants. So let's check the prices on the Elites, and we'll list them up. Uh, I would assume the Elite ones... I don't know, the 80 ones are going to be worthless. Alright, what you going for? Okay, I can live with that. 12k. Alright, so we got this guy going up for 12k. But like I said, that was a 2100 pack. So, or 2100 point pack. So that's five goat golds essentially. Uh, and five goat golds would guarantee me about. 50 or about 60k that's what i would value that about 60k and so at about 60k i don't think i'm gonna get it here unless justin Pugh is worth a lot more than i thought and i could potentially get more from the gold gold the goat golds but those packs are just so far and away the best packs this wasn't bad i didn't have too bad of luck here not bad at all, but it w it was in no way. Okay, but these these elite giants are gonna sell like crazy. That's kind of cheap. Almost just want to keep them and use them for that. But you need 16 players in your lineup. The good thing is, is you got a lot more spots in your lineup than 16, so it shouldn't be too big of an issue. But I don't know. I'll make a we'll make a lineup here to end out this video. We'll also open up one more baby goat pack. Yeah, these things are selling before you can even post them. You post them and they sell. Alright, alright, Justin Pugh. 
All right, all right, that's not bad, not bad. 27-ish K. I'll listen for 27 because they're selling that quick, but that's not bad at all. I want to get the non auction I want to get non auctionable tradable offensive linemen so I can sell my auctionable tradable ones, but I just haven't been able to have the option for good offensive linemen. Because they, they, they do have some nice value, and I do have some offensive linemen with some high values. Okay, 27.75. Yeah, they just sell. They just sell like crazy. So we're back over 500k. I'm happy about that. So Giants Elites. Probably just any Elites from any team are selling quickly. So we'll open up one more... One more goat gold, and then I'll hold on to the rest of my points. You really want three goat golds out of this. That's always my hope is three goat. Okay, gold kicker. They have some value. There's the ray. Okay, there we go. There's two goat golds. Okay, two goat golds, pretty good. Pretty good. That's, that's kind of the perfect... Um, it's more than you expect with the one. Okay, we'll open up one more because I have a stupid addiction to opening up these goat golds. But it's better than the one that you expect. There's Dion. First card, that's good. Okay, okay, there we go. Two cards. Two gold golds. Eli Rogers. Come on, give it to me. Give it to me! Oh, okay. George Iloka, that's not a bad pull. Two gold golds again, so that's good. I'll stop pulling gold, gold, goat golds from that for now. Uh, and let's go ahead and try to build this team. Dude, I don't know what's going on outside my house. I can't, I like, I went for, I had to go to the bank. Um, because when I get the deposits from my gambling, I, I, I have to sign off on them. I don't have to sign off on DraftKings. I just have to sign off it, like, because it's, it's, it's like from a weird place and the bank like doesn't trust it so i have to go sign off for it and it's not like a weird place i guess that's not the proper term it's not a weird place but it's it's not a place that the bank like re it's not like a generic place where the bank's like oh hey this is a store that we should trust so to go to the bank to sign off and i couldn't find any of the construction work going on okay so i want randy moss we need randy moss in the lineup okay so we got we got moss i need moss to complete these solo challenges uh, we have Zach Ertz at tight end, so that's good. So I'm high of an 85 overall with two players in my lineup. Okay, so we need Nigel Bradham. He's an Eagles player. I don't even know what the other Eagles player I had in my lineup. Who was it? Was it a lineman? No. Who was the other Eagles player that I had? I actually have no idea who the other Eagles player was. It's not a corner. It wasn't a safety. It wasn't a defensive tackle. I don't know who the other Eagles player in my lineup is. Hold on. Let me switch. Switch back to lineup two. Who is it? Who is the other Eagles player? This is very confusing. Who is the other Eagles player in my lineup? How do I have tier three or tier one Eagles? Oh, Donnie Jones. Okay. Okay, my punter is the other Eagles player. Okay. Change active lineups. Punter Donnie Jones. Alright, so there we go. We've got the we got the tier one Eagles chemistry. Oh, I don't need Ray Lewis. Do I have Okay, we got a Cowboys. That's left outside linebacker, though. We don't have any middle linebackers. Okay. Let me put Landon Collins in at strong safety. Because we got him. So let's put him in. Let's see here. Free safety. Do we have anybody free for either of the teams? We still got to... All right, let's put Darian Thompson in. We just need one more Giants player to activate the chemistry. Do we have a right outside linebacker? We do not. And I guess that's good. I get Telvin Smith in my lineup then. Uh, D tackle. Okay, so we've got we've got Cedric Thornton. So there's a Cowboys player. Right end. Okay, right end. We got Vinny Curry. Okay, so oh no, we don't need Vinny Curry because he's an Eagles player. Already activated the chemistry for the Eagles. All right, so Giants. Uh, there's no Giants. Okay, so there's a Redskins player. 
All right, so we've got... We need one more Giants, two more Redskins, two more Cowboys. Yeah, two more Cowboys. Okay, so Corners. Are we looking at a corner? Do we? Okay, so we got Eli Apple. We got Eli Apple and we got Bashad Freeland. Okay. So let's go ahead. Actually, hold on. Let me hold off on that for just a second. Wide receiver, what are we looking like? Do we have... Do we not actually have a wide receiver from any of these? Two? Okay, we do not have a wide receiver. We do not. Okay, we, okay, we got Tavares King. There you go. There's our Giants player. Okay, so there we go. Giants chemistry is activated. That means I can use Megatron. Um, I might as well just use Dak at quarterback. I guess. Man, hold on. Hold on. Okay, so we can use Larry Allen. We can continue his uh, things. His, his challenges. Or does he not count for the Cowboys? Okay, no, no, he counts for the Cowboys. Okay. Lineman. Okay, so we got a Redskin center. We'll throw him in there. Does that complete the Redskins, or do I need one more? I need one more Skins, one more Cowboys. One more Skins, one more Cowboys. You do not want this. Okay, right tackle. Do we got any Cowboys, Redskins, right tackle? Yes, I have Morgan Moses. So there's the Redskins or uh, Redskins chemistry activated. So we just need a Cowboys player. One more Cowboys player. Do I have a Cowboy left tackle? I do not. Um, I don't have a Cow Do I have a Cowboys corner? I have to go buy a Cowboys play. Oh, nope, nope, I can use Baby Goat Deion Sanders. I'll use Chabote Awuzi because I don't want to have to... I want to sell the Dion, so we'll do it this way. Okay, so I activated all the chemistries. Should be good to go. It wasn't actually that bad. Makes your team like a piece of garbage unless you actually have elites for them, but I don't, so... Let's see, let's make sure that we're all activated and ready to go, and then I'll open up one more baby goat pack because I have a serious issue. And we are good to go. We got the premium qualifier all unlocked. It's 9k coins, that's good, so I'll be playing those today. Probably won't record them because, I don't know, you guys don't need, I feel like they're just regular, so okay, one more baby goat pack, we'll call it an episode. Starting it off with the silver. Alright, that's not great. Oh, hold on, I, I want to do it. Oh, we got an elite. Alright, uh, Kenny Vaccaro. Okay, there's our baby goat. And, okay, two baby goats. Alright, we're on a roll of two baby goats. We also got the Kenny Vaccaro. It, see, I just expect when I open these, okay, I'm going to get a baby goat, and that's all. I'm going to get some silvers and golds to possibly sell. But it's really just the baby goat. And that's it. When I pull, like, the extra Brady and the Vaccaro, that's, like, an extra 18k in this pack. So, this is, like, a 30k pack. So, that's why I like these so much. That's why they're so clutch um, for making coins and whatnot. It's the gold golds. I'll open up one more, and then I gotta stop, because I gotta save I gotta save points. So, this is the last one. I'm serious. So we're gonna get all the silvers out of the way. Okay, we literally just got all the silvers out. Paul Kruger, two cards left. Can I clutch it out with one final baby goat? Nope, silver, okay. So yeah, this is kind of the pack that I expect to get. Uh, nothing great. Uh, another thing that's great are these non-auctionable tradable baby goats because you can use them for the collection. That's really all that matters there. And you can pull elites and you can pull actual good stuff out of them. So that's why I like those so much. Uh, and I also like these get a player packs. They're always fun to open and you can actually pull some good stuff out of them. As I showed, you can pull elites out of them and whatnot. So they're always kind of fun to open up a couple of those. But guys, that's going to do this for the video. That was the kind of builder for the, I don't know, the builder for the NFC East. Not too bad to make a team. Um, I'll be in business when it comes to like the NFC North because I've got Calvin. I've got Barry already. I've got Randy Moss. I already got a ton of players from the NFC North. Uh, so that'll be really nice when that comes up. Uh, but guys, that's that's it that's all you really got to do it's actually not as many players in your lineup as i thought so um 
yeah, I would actually suggest doing these. Get those gauntlet trophies. Hold on to them because I believe the first two are really the only two that are really usable in my honest opinion. So keep that in mind. But guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. Drop the video a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Peace out. Letting go, times we might feel like looking down from the heights that we